Ten years. Yeah. Crazy ten years in a lot of respects. Yeah, well, I think it's it's had absolutely everything, like um, a double relegation, some promotions, um, a lot of stuff in between. Um, Premier League, obviously you get to live my dream now in the Premier League. Um, European quarterfinals, heartbreak in the FA Cup semi-final. It took a while to get over. Um, so yeah, look, 10 of the best years really. Um, and that's not 10 more, but let's see if we can get five or six more out of them. How different are you? Do you think you're different from the boy who first arrived 10 years ago? Um, yeah, different in a way of I probably um, obviously mature, obviously matured, um, take the game more seriously now. Where I didn't really take it that seriously at the start. I guess maybe you're young, and you're just kind of off, just doing doing whatever. Um, in terms of my game, obviously you improve as the years go on, but the the thought process of my game is still the same. How I want to play, um, like I was still trying to play. Um, back then, when I when I was eighteen, I'm still tr still trying to play that now. Like with the type of game that I have is not dropping step overs and going down going down the wing. I was never I was never doing that. I was always like a kind of link up player, one twos combinations, etc. So um, obviously I've just gotten better at that. But um, I don't know. Maybe maybe you can ask some of the lads if, if I've changed. I, I hope it's any changes that they say I have made are all good ones. Well, obviously I've known you a long time. I was there. When you made your debut, I was there. Oh yeah. When you scored the, your first goal, is yeah. um, Doncaster. Yeah. You were there, yeah. yeah. We had your first interview after scoring at Forest yeah. for the first goal a long time ago. If I said anything, I would say you're more relaxed now. Yeah, possibly, but I think um, was it possible to get more relaxed than I than I really was? Um, I think that's always been kind of a trait of mine where I was very laid back. Um, I guess probably comes from my mum's side, being half Dutch, that she's just a really relaxed person. My dad isn't really like that, so um, I don't know. Like I, sometimes people say like you you look a bit lazy sometimes, but it's not. I just think it's just the the way I carry myself. It's just quite laid back and just um, relaxed. And but I, I'm still serious on the inside. I'm still obviously I know what I'm doing. I'm still trying to perform and, and win games, etc. But just not in your face about it. Just the way I say that is that I think I wonder how much of it in the early years was you trying to prove to yourself and to everyone and to nail down a place. Yeah. And once you did, yeah, your true football has come out. Yeah. Well, you've got to get comfortable, I guess, and kind of get health. Probably being at the same club that you just totally comfortable in the with your surroundings. Um, if you keep moving, then you. Spend a lot of time trying to get comfortable where you are, and then you move again, and then you can never really um, comfortable. Not in terms of people say getting comfortable is bad, but I mean just comfortable in in being able to kind of be a bit more relaxed, um, not take things that don't need to be taken seriously too seriously. Um, so yeah, look, I I understand that I am quite laid back, and then, but I, I don't I don't mind it. Works for me. Is it weird that you've been here this long? That you've I mean. The training ground's different. Yeah, everything. Every, different. Everything is different, um, except for Ron. Ron was still here when uh, when I was when I came. Um, it's not weird, I guess. You just kind of go with the f with the flow and go with the times. When you see change, you kind of just kind of get on with it. Um, I'm just amazed at how I've managed to survive through all the like change of managers, change of philosophies, change of owners um, so like I've said before that gives me fills me with great pride and uh, to think that I've obviously, I'm obviously doing something right on the pitch that makes um, all the managers who would have had opportunity to say listen we want to go a different way um, still think that I can I can play a part and and um, and, and get a game because you once won player of the year playing left back yeah that, and that wasn't actually that long ago really what was it four, four, yeah. four, four years ago four and a half years ago um, and you know what? I actually liked playing. I actually liked playing there because I got you get to cut in, and I was getting like going forward. I felt like I was getting loads of shots off and stuff like that. 
Um, but we, were, we weren't winning many games, so maybe that, maybe that was the reason, because I was playing left-back and Cody was playing right-back. Um, that's a good, that's a good full-back combination, that is. Um, but like now, when I think about it, I would just hate to go back to left-back. Uh, I would just, I guess when you play right-wing back now for, what, three years straight, um, I guess I just love the position. I get to go to the back post up that end. Obviously, I know I have to go back the other end, but it's just um, when you're playing in a team, with this much quality in it, uh, it's just a joy.